Red fan Yelmas has officially signed for Rangers. We knew this deal was going to happen. It was more just when rather than if. And it looks like it's around €6 million. Euros. Uh, I think it's a good deal. He's 21. Bright future ahead of him. It is from Besiktas, so it's looking around. Of course, it was in Euro, so it's looking around. It says here, it's an initial fee of €3.4 million that could rise to 53 with add-ons. This 21-year-old played 72 times for Besiktas after coming through the youth ranks and has six caps for his country. He said, I've heard so much about the Rangers <laughs> and cannot wait to play in front of them. I'm delighted to be joining the club the size of Rangers. I'm really looking forward to meeting my new teammates. Uh, he won the Super League with Besiktas last season, the season before. And of course, he's been brought in to yeah, fill a void. Uh, Calvin Bassey created and of course we brought in Ben Davis and we brought in John Sutter but we have lost Balogun and Bassey you know at the back so have we improved? Nah I don't think we've improved to be honest I mean like, but time will tell Bassey was an immense player I mean is Ben Davis an improvement on Balogun? I mean everyone would say you're brain dead for saying he's not but he has to prove it first in my eyes I mean Balogun was fucking good at good at the, the level he was at, Europa League, you know, every time Balogun played, Balogun doesn't put many foot wrong, I'm surprised we didn't actually just keep him on a deal, to be honest, but we didn't, um, and, I mean, this guy, like, he was, he had less than a year on his contract, that's a bit mad, in my opinion, that he had less than a year on his contract, and that's what we've paid, and we're going to pay 5.4 million, we've paid half for this guy, what we fucking sold the Rebo for, to me, that just doesn't sound right, to be perfectly honest. But, be interested to see if he will come straight in against Livingston. Probably not. I'm trying to hink win is the first game in the Cup. I mean, he'll probably make a few appearances from the bench, but he'll pro my, my thinking will be that he'll start against Queen of the South. I'd be surprised if he comes straight in against Livingston, you know. Even though Barisic was a bit shaky against Tottenham, you know. Um, I don't think Gio will w wing him straight in there. But, of course, we heard in previous weeks that Gio said that Yilmaz here is the last piece of the puzzle. But some guy commented on my feed with a very valid point. There is nothing worse when you get to the end of a jigsaw and there's a few pieces missing. Exactly. Is that is that us completed? Is that us sorted to win the league? Get into the Champions League group stages? I'm not completely convinced, you know, because I think there's probably going to be some more outgoings as well. Um, another news though, Tav has agreed to 2026, so that's a very good deal. But uh, yeah, leave your thoughts down below. Is that us done, or do you think they're just talking shit? I mean, there's no reason really to talk shit. I mean, because people love transfer talk. I love transfer talk, but I mean, the window isn't over for like another 38 days, and here we are. On the 25th of July, saying we're done. Come on, Rangers, what's going on?